part five of my entire DVD and Blu-ray collection, which is also the final part of this collection. Now I'm going to be showing off my stack of Blu-rays, which are right there. So, without further ado, let's go and get this final part started. Let, and let's start with my favorite movie of all time. Here's the extended collector's edition Blu-ray of Avatar. I also have the theatrical version on DVD. Do hope to get another copy of this soon. Um, um, with a slipcover. Yeah, I do hope to get another exact um, copy of this with a slipcover. I also do hope to get um, Avatar The Way of Water soon, as I remember seeing that movie in theaters um, December of last year. And that was an awesome movie. Not better than the first Avatar, though. Hold on. There you go. fantastic movie right here highly recommend it to people to people who haven't seen this movie yet it's a great movie problem probably my second favorite batman movie first one being the dark knight in which i in which um that movie is also my second favorite movie of all time um Cotter Egg expired uh, June 30th, 2023, but here it is if you want it. Oh, yeah, I also have The Dark Knight on DVD, if I didn't tell you that. I also have um, Batman Begins on DVD and Lego Batman, the movie DC Superheroes Unite on DVD, which is caseless. <laughs> Also has this exact movie on DVD. I also have um, Cars Two on DVD, which is tasteless, and Cars Three on Blu-ray, which I'm gonna show you next. Oh yeah, this one I saw in theaters back in um, 2017. Cars 2 I also see, saw in theaters. Which is was the, also the first time I ever saw a movie in theaters. No joke. I actually saw Cars 2 in theaters. When I was like... I was 2 when that movie came out, I think. Oh yeah, I think I, think I was 2. Alright, there we go. Here's Elimination's first ever movie. And this Blu-ray I got yesterday. I also have Despicable Me 2 on DVD, which I plan to upgrade to Blu-ray. <laughs> And I also do hope to get um, Despicable Me 3, Minions, and Minions Rise of Gru. Which Minions and Minions Rise of Gru I saw in theaters. Um, Minions in 2015 and Minions Rise of Gru in 20... No, 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 no. no. Um, last year, I saw Minions Rise of Gru last year in theaters. And Minions Rise of Gru was, was better than... Um, was, a, was better than um, the first Minions. Back of this insert is black, so I'm not gonna show it. I'm not gonna show the back. And 
And the next Blu-ray I'm going to show you, you're not going to like this one. Yep. Considered to be one of the worst animated films of all time. And, um, I actually do not like this movie anymore. Yep, I don't like this movie anymore. Can't believe I used to like it. No, I don't like it anymore. But I'm still going to keep this for collection purposes only, as it is the only Sony Blu-ray I currently have for now. This one I saw in theaters back in 2016. Yeah, the next one's a 4K. This is also a Target exclusive. And I saw this movie in theaters back in... Um, no, I think November of 2019. Yeah, I also have, um... I also have, um... First Frozen on DVD. Which I already showed you that DVD in part... Um, one. Um, if you hear any, hear any sniffling, it's because I'm... I'm sort of sick. I'm not gonna show the um the the filmmaker gallery slash storybook because uh, eh, it might take too long. My favorite Christmas movie of all time. I freaking love this movie. And fun fact, um, the DVD actually uses the opening from 1999, which I did not know that before. Code already expired October 15, 2018, but I guess if you want it, I mean, uh, and, um, get it back to the answer is Blake. Wait, is it? All right, it's back. I do hope to get Home Alone 2 soon, um, but I'm not sure if I'm going to get Home Alone 3. Um, but I'm definitely not going to bother with Home Alone 4 and 5 as well because um, I did not like those movies. I hated them. And if Home Sweet Home Alone gets and gets released on physical media then I'm too not then I'm also not gonna bother with that one because because I also hate that movie also have this movie on DVD which was part of the um, Ice Age 5 movie collection um that same thing with the next one I'm gonna show you next I also have the um the 2005 the 2002 DVD of the first Ice Age and um yeah Alright. Now this one I also have the DVD as well as part of the Ice Age Five Movie Collection set. Yeah, I don't like this movie. It was a disappointment. Even however, this movie though is definitely better than Ice Age The Adventures of Buck Wild the Ice Age The Adventures of Buck Wild, which I hate. And this Blu-ray I also got yesterday, and it's now the oldest Blu-ray I have in my collection. Um, yep, um, 
uh, surpassing Transformers Revenge of the Fallen. I also have the um, the 2003 Indiana Jones Complete Adventures box set. Um, oh, along with the Ice Age Complete Adventure Collection um, DVD um, um, set. Which also features um, all the four um, Indiana Jones movies. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I speak of, um, I did see Dawn of Destiny in theaters, if you didn't know. Great Pixar movie. Plan on watching it soon, if I have time. Yeah, um, yeah. This side won't. This side won't close. It was like that when I got it. Um, next one's also a 4K. I haven't seen this movie yet, but I do want to check it out. Wait, um, yeah, I think I have seen, I showed you this, but, um, I'll just show you the posters that are inside, so, yeah, yeah, back of the, you know, this blank, wait, I need to go, they're, they're both back in the back, hold on. Focus. Yeah. This movie I saw in theaters back in 2016, and it was a great sequel. Cannot wait for the fourth movie that's coming out um, 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 December of next year. Next was a Diamond Edition Blu ray. I also have um, The Lion King on Diamond Edition Blu-ray, which is caseless. I also have to get the uh, the 2008, no, 2006 or 7 Diamond Edition um, DVD of The Little Mermaid. Oh, and I haven't seen the live-action remake yet, which I might check that out soon now that it's on Disney+. Plus. I also have the first three out on DVD, which is Caseless. Yeah, the case is in terrible condition. Yeah, this side won't close. Um. Yeah, the DVD is completely scratched up. And the Blu-ray. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I might have to get a new... Hoping to get a better copy of this soon. Four left. And then we're done with the whole collection. 
of my all-time favorite movies right here, period. And second favorite James Cameron movie. First one, me and Avatar, which is also my favorite movie of all time, like I mentioned. Yeah, the DVD is split into two parts. Here's the code if you want it. Um, wait. Already expired um, September 10th, 2013. Um, but that is if you want it. I also have the first Transformers movie on DVD. And I do hope to get the other Transformers movie soon. And this was the oldest movie I have in my collection until, um, yeah, um, Indiana Jones and Kingdom of the Crystal Skull surpassed that, in which I already showed the Blu-ray. Um, this movie I thought wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, this sign also won't close. I had this Blu-ray for, for, I think, six. Maybe 2015 or 16 or 14, I don't know. Probably, I don't think 2017. So, yeah. Here's the last, um, Blu-ray. And the last piece of physical media for the entire collection. Zootopia. Oh, hold on. Yeah, same thing with the Cars Blu-ray. This was also released during um, Pixar's one. I mean Disney's one hundredth anniversary. Wait, maybe I accidentally said Pixar's one hundredth anniversary when I showed the Blu-ray of Cars. I don't know if I did, but we all make mistakes. Right. And that is it for the entire DVD and Blu-ray collection. Oh my goodness, I showed you a lot. Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.